chief Lance Imo State says troops must redouble effort against IPOB members. <laughs> Do you think this is the best way to deal with issues like this? Because using Nigerian security force on the IPOB and ESN, I don't think is going to solve any issue, but it will cause more problem to Nigeria. I say, oh, yeah, that is just the, 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 the gospel truth. But funny enough, the leaders of the uh, Southeasterners, they are all they're watching why all these things are happening under their, under their watch. If the Nigerian government is using the strength they are using right now in the Southeast to fight insurgency and bandits, the Fulani uh, killers, you know, I'm talking about the criminals among the Fulani herdsmen, you know, that be disturbing the peace of Nigerians. I don't think by now we should still be talking about uh, insecurity challenges in this country. No, by now everything would have, you know, ceased. But it's really very, very worrisome and disturbing the way the federal government is approaching this issue of Southeasterners. Honestly, I don't think this is the best. Anyway, guys, let's get straight to the news and get the full details. But before then, if you are here for the first time, kindly subscribe. And don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Thank you very much. I really do appreciate. The chief of the army staff, Major General Farouk Yahaya, on Wednesday visited Uwere Imo State, saying he came for an on-the-spot assignment of the security situation of the state. Yahaya, who met with troops of 34 Brigade in Obinze Barak, Uwere, urged them to be dogged and decisive against the indigenous people of Biafra IPOB, which he said was disturbing the peace of the state. According to a release by the director, Army Public Relations Brigade General Onyama Wachuku, the Army Chief lauded the, the troops of 40, sorry, 34 brigades and operatives of other security agencies in turning the tide the tidy of the recent sparks of insecurity that resulted from the criminal activities of the uh, proscribed group of IPOB in Imo State. He said General Yahaya made the commendation today at Obinze Barak, Uwiri, Imo State, while addressing the troops during his median operation visit to headquarters. Sorry, Headquarters 34 Brigade. He told the troops that his visit was informed by the need to have an on-the-spot assignment of the security situation in the state. The Chief of Army Staff expressed delight on the success so far recorded by the troops and urged them to redouble their efforts in order to end all the activities of IPOB in Imo State. General Yahaya further changed, charged them to be loyal and exhibit high sense of duty at all times. He pointed out that more success would be recorded through compliance to instructions and loyalty to superior authority. The Chief of Army Staff also called on the officers to always led by example and assure their, that troops are adequately briefed and kept abreast of the mission at hand. In a show of synergy, the Chief of Army Staff also paid a visit to troops of 111 Response Group Nigerian Air Force Uwiri, where he employed the troops to be professional and alert at at all times. He appreciated them for their spirit of jointness and synergy towards tackling insecurity in the state. Highlight of the walking tour was Chief of Staff visit to the proposed military hospital Uwiri and the tour of Obinze Ibarak. A lot of Nigerians have reacted to this. 
Every of your aim is at the Igbos for destruction, but end with humble them. The governors in the east and their families that have failed to advise them will regret. They must redouble their effort against IPOB and ESN, which means the Nigerian army is finding it difficult over there in the east in direct confusion from the army chief. Mm. Even if they triple their efforts, we can never be intimidated or silent. IPOB has come to stay. Even if it will decide to suspend this agitation, one thing I know they will never do is to have a peaceful coexistence with their haters. They might secretly start doing unthinkable. Anybody can be evil too. Not be one, not be only some people said. You should continue showing your mercies. I don't blame you. I blame the useless Zoom politicians from our glorious and blessed Igbo land. You should channel that energy to south to northern Nigeria where bandits and Boko Haram re or lose after the initial gragara you you condemn. We are proud of that nation. Our troops need to restore confidence to the general public against at louded at loaded IPOP terrorists, not only in Imo, but entire Southeast and Nigeria. All right. Anybody wasting, waiting for uh, President Muhammad Buhari to decentralize or restructure Nigeria is a fool. Buhari has spoken his mind. He cannot restructure Nigeria. What else do you want again from him? Instead of you to go and join Freedom Agitation Group, you are busy lamenting restructuring every time president Muhammad Buhari tenor will end in May 28 2023 allow him to finish his legitimate tenor I beg stop all this so that peace will reign just stop disturbing the old man all right I said so guys we've all heard it now I'm dropping it here hit the comment section and don't forget to give us thumbs up thank you very much for stopping by I really do appreciate bye for now